Hey everyone, so most often some students they get confused between these two terms that is pathogen and antigen. They thought that the pathogen is in total an antigen but that is not the actual fact. So what it is, let's understand in this session. Before proceeding to the today's session, if you have not subscribed my channel yet, then please consider subscribing. So first, what is pathogen? Pathogen is a disease-causing organism. So, what are the disease-causing organisms? Uh, the, it may be the living and some are non-living disease-causing organisms are there. Living disease-causing organisms or pathogens are bacteria, protozoans, okay, even fungi and uh, some pathogens are also non-living disease causing organisms they cause disease in their host body so what are those like um, virus actually virus it is a connecting link between living and non-living organism and another example is prion okay so pathogen it is a disease causing organism some pathogens are living and some are non-living and let's say this one is a it is a pathogen and on the surface of pathogen has unique antigens okay these are the unique antigens which are present on the surface of pathogen okay so the pathogen as a whole is not an antigen on the surface of pathogen there are specific antigens or unique antigens are present okay and these antigens they will bind to the antibody and it will generate immuno response okay clear what is pathogen pathogen is a disease causing organism and on the surface of pathogen unique antigens are present that means whole pathogen is not an antigen okay pathogen has unique antigen on its surface like this or some part of the pathogen they act as an antigen and that antigen it generate the immuno response okay so now what is an antigen okay antigen is any foreign substance that induce or stimulate immuno response so what are the examples let's say as i told you before that antigens are the molecules that are present on the surface of pathogen on the surface of pathogen some antigens are present so antigens also we can antigens are okay antigen it is represented by a g okay a is for the antibody g is for generator okay antibody generator that is the antigen so i am writing here as a g uh, so antigens are molecules present on the surface of pathogen okay and you know its primary response is to stimulate the immuno response even the foods that cause the allergies that are also antigens okay antigens though mostly they are present on microorganisms but other substances like some chemicals food that cause allergy even pollens also auto immuno disorder disease these are antigen okay hope now you have a clear idea about what is pathogen and what is an antigen if you like this video and find it useful then please don't forget to subscribe my channel stay tuned for more such informative videos bye bye see you in my next video till then keep learning